Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, come on in, put your feet up, get yourself comfortable, just relax. Hi. <laughs> so today I'm going to do Northern Lights. Now I did a version of this in the advent and I wasn't happy with it. I had tried different techniques and they just didn't work. So when I seen this lady called Amanda Byerney, I think her name is. I'll put her name on the screen. Um, you can go and check her out then. And I seen how she did it and it was perfect. So I wanted to have a go at it and, you know, redeem the last one that I did. <laughs> so I've went ahead and I've done two coats of black. Again, make sure they're nice and thin because it's very pigmented and you want it to cure properly. Then I've done a coat of matte top coat. And now I'm going in with white ink, white art ink. And I'm just going to do my swoopy swoops across the nail with some white art ink. And I know this sounds insane, but it works. It's amazing. Such a clever lady. And I was like, I need to try this because I've really wanted to make the Northern Lights look more realistic. Now here is where the magic happens. I'm going in with some matte top coat. Yes, you heard me right. Matte top coat. And look what it does. It's amazing. It just, Yes. That is exactly what I was looking for. It creates that nice column. Oh, it's just amazing. So once I've done that, I cured that in the lamp and then I'm gonna take um, glass gel polish. You can choose any colors you want. I just went with these colors because they were very similar to what she did. And I'm just gonna rub them in with my applicator brush. And I'm gonna add some darker green. And again, I'm just gonna work that in and give it some depth like so and I cure that in the lamp and then I'm going to go back over it again with some matte top coat there we go and now I'm going to create some trees I'm sure I did yes I did I did a winter scene nail and I did some trees so it's very similar to that um Amanda did her nails her um trees very differently so this is how I'm doing my trees we're just, we're going for it with a wee detailer brush. That's what we're doing. We're going for it. <laughs> so I'm doing it in a V shape on either side. So you're pulling kind of diagonal on either side and then you're getting wider as you come down. So the tree fills out. And I'm just going to do that in all of them. So I do three, three wee trees. There we go. Then we're just going to add some snow because it's, why not? Why not? <laughs> Who knows, by the time this is up, we might have snow because that's how we roll here. <laughs> we could have snow in March <laughs> or April. <laughs> so I'm just adding wee bits of snow in the branches. It's quite simple. I'm just so impressed with this technique. I just want to do it in everything. <laughs> I love it. All credit to Amanda, you are spot on, you're amazing. Um, there we go. So we're just doing the last wee dinky tree. This is the dinky tree. There we go. So as usual, there's gonna be a wee starburst in the sky because we love it. Why not? There's always stars in the sky. <laughs> so it's just a simple wee thing that just adds a wee bit of something once I've done that, I'll cure that and then I'm going to go in and do some other wee just dots just to give it some more depth. There we go. And then I'm going to get my iced violet micro flakes and put some base coat down and just sprinkle some of them because that's going to add just a wee bit more depth again, give you a wee bit more something to catch the eye because you know, the, the northern lights aren't enough. <laughs> and then I'm going to top coat it. And again, I did this matte because I just felt it was nice matte. I will do shiny. I just hate photographing shiny. It's a pain in the bum. <laughs> and this is the finished result. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. <sighs> Leave a wee comment. Join us over on Facebook. <laughs> and do all the things. Do all the things. <laughs> And I really hope to see you in the next one. I love you lots. Bye. Take care.